Hi, this is Carl Anderson with Marine Max Charleston, located just off Daniel Island. And today I'm going to take you through Boston Whalers 2020 230 Vantage. We'll start off here at the, at the transom. Overall, this boat is 24 feet, 7 inches long, including the swim platforms. You have swim platforms that are angled out away from the motor. You've got a full walk across along the transom, so you can easily get from one side of the boat to the other. other. This boat has the fishing package, which also includes two rod holders here at the transom. To the starboard side, we have a telescoping fold-up ladder that tucks away into the swim platform, along with a stainless grab handle, so it's easy to get in and out of the boat. The boat is powered with Mercury's new V8 300 Verado. It also has a top cowling service door, so I can check and change my oil. I can engage this lever, and now I can remove the cowling um, just with the single, single lever, all with one arm. So really easy to do, really quiet, smooth motor. A lot of torque, a lot of displacement. As we make our way into the cockpit, all of your fishing accommodations are back here. And the stern seat is folded up. Got a nice padded bolster. Also with that fishing package, we have a raw water wash down. And a live well with a blue interior. I'll deploy this stern seat. Big oversized stern seat. Easily seats two adults comfortably, maybe even three children. No exposed hardware, big oversized cushion, and again, easily stows away and opens up this cockpit space. Huge bilge access here for a boat in this category and class. All finished out, easy to keep clean, easy to access everything. Absolutely not an afterthought, something that had a lot of intention behind it from Boston Whalers design team. We got a closable and lockable cockpit door right here. Battery switches beneath that bolster. Entering the transom, this is one of four freshwater sprayers on the boat. Got rod holders along the back. We have a place to mount a picnic table, one of two. There's also one in the bow. Staying on the port side here. This uh, port side lounger has an adjustable backrest that has multiple locking positions. So I can have it facing aft. I can drop it all the way down, and now I have a nice sunbed or a bench that comfortably seats three. And if I leave that forward piece down and engage that backrest, now I've got a lounger facing forward. If I bring this backrest up, this section is open for storage. Really versatile, versatile seating space on the boat. We'll come back over here to starboard. We've got a... Wet bar sink prep area with a Corian countertop, cup holders, storage area that's drained, fresh water sprayer number two on the boat. Got a Yeti cooler that's a designated space for that, slides out otherwise. Panning up to the hard top, got rod holders on both sides. We have the matching blue gel coat color up beneath the hard top as this um, boat has the light blue gel coat exterior. Really big, beefy hard top, great sun coverage. Not gonna shake, not gonna rattle. Just really solid. Moving further forward, the 230 Vantage has a really comfortable helm, flip up bolster, angled footrest, got a nice vinyl wrap steering wheel, a vinyl appointed brow. We've got a nine inch Ray Marine unit on this boat, a four inch Mercury vessel view display, Fusion Bluetooth stereo, We've got charging ports and an auxiliary port for your devices, trim tabs, jail audio speakers. This boat has an outstanding sound system. So checking out the head area on the 230 Vantage. Got a lot of headroom on this boat. This is a self-contained porcelain head with a pump out and an overboard discharge. We've got an overhead light. We've got hanging clips and towels or a change of clothes. There is a freshwater sink there on the port side. It's hot and cold water. We've got storage down here in the deck with rod holders. We've got a door to a trash receptacle. I can block off this windshield. This is great for colder days. It really protects the cockpit area. 
But additionally, that opens up a storage locker there. And that storage locker is also continued further forward beneath one of the bow cushions, which I'll show you here. So I can access that storage space from either side, but it also just makes it to where you've got a large amount of space for larger items like uh, beach bags, all of our canvases in here, including a bow sunshade kit. So it really is a versatile space for this, this side boat. Here in the bow, got a lot of depth, got recessed stainless steel grab rails. We have two cup holders on both sides, another set of JL speakers up here. Again, another uh, mount for a picnic table, a pocketed area for phones or sunscreen. Again, rod holders for that, that bow sunshade kit. Our fourth freshwater sprayer on the boat. A windless anchor. That's remote controlled in addition to the controls that you have at the dash. Everywhere you see snaps, we do have bow and cockpit canvas for this boat. And lastly, we've got more storage here to the port side. You can also see everything is finished out nice and clean. And even the cup holders are plumbed and drained. That's a look at our 230 Vantage from Boston Whaler. Again, my name is Carl Anderson with Marine Max Charleston. We're located just off Daniel Island at 142 Sportsman Island Drive. If you have any questions about this boat or any of our others, give us a call at 843-747-1889. And always check us out on marinemax.com. Thanks for watching.